on game night, Deborah, Nikki, and me, Lincoln, are going to teach and share to play Micro Macro Crime City, a game for one to four players designed by Johannes Sick and published by Edition Spielweis. Well, let's go dig in there and see if we can figure out who committed these crimes. Hi, Lincoln. Hey, Nikki P. Can you teach us Micro Macro Crime City? That is the name of this. We are <laughs> detectives in Crime City, a city that has a lot of crime. I can't believe they named their city Crime City. <laughs> But it's a giant map where there's many cases. And it's basically, like Scott says, it's time travel. You're going back and seeing throughout the day what has happened. Although, I don't know about that one that was, we were, Deborah found, right away, found a crime scene <laughs> and went all the way backwards. That one had to have been over a couple of days. But yeah, um, but yeah you're going back in time. And because you're starting with the crime scene. We actually have one here mapped out and we'll zoom in on it in a moment, but this is just one that they give you where they give you just the, the crime scene and then you do the rest. It's online ones, they actually have online ones. Yeah. And so you're following to figure out what happened that led to this point. And it's that way with all of these. They have, I mean, this is a lot of stuff happening yeah. here. But what we're gonna do is we have a deck of cards. There's 16 cases, this will be spoilery. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna do the introductory case, which is very quick. And um, first, and then we're going to do one of these big long ones because it's amazing how much of the board they, they take up when you start to really get into the crimes. Deborah will be our master investigator. She's going to read <laughs> us, She's going to read the cards and tell us, you know, it tells you what you do on each card. It says this is the start of the case and you're going to do the first element that it has in there. So the, this introductory case will give us some information. We'll go over that in a moment. The other ones will be a little bit more where it just directly tells you to find the crime scene specifically then it asks you specific investigation questions in the timeline. And then so you go back and see if you can find them out. And then it might ask you like things that they did. So there could be a card with a bunch of things that they've mm. done. And if you want to make sure you're thorough and you want to check them all off, but if you just see the types of things that they were doing, mm. which helps lead to what's, what's happening in the case. So this one here was one that we saw online and it's, it tells you to find the guy shoving the person into the to, into the uh, lake or the sea. So Harvard. let's zoom in on that. Okay. So Nikki P, go ahead. And, and a, a couple other things is we're using these. Oh yeah, these tiddlywinks. Yeah. Tiddlywinks to highlight for yeah, the camera. Yeah, they're not part very of the game. Helpful, though. Very, yeah. very helpful. And the game also comes with this little magnifier Sheet, yep. uh, mm -hmm. thing. And then I've added my <laughs> heavy duty Sherlock one. Holmes. That's not quite Sherlock Holmes, but that's still it's pretty, pretty good. pretty heavy duty. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but there you go. Okay. okay, so let's zoom in on so we can show that initial crime. Don't want to mess this up. We've, since we've tracked everything down, that's we won't be doing it like this. We'll actually grow from that, I imagine, on the other ones. Yeah. So here, there's a person shoving a person into the water, and you want to find out why this happened. So you follow them back. And Deborah's done. She found all of these. You see the, the guy on the bicyclist is the guy that's shoving the person in the water. This guy's just walking along. I think this is his car. Because we see him here. Yep, in his car here. Let's zoom over to that. Don't worry. We'll move. Yep. Move the map. Being followed by the guy on the bike. Yep. And if you keep going, here they are again. He's still being followed. And if you keep going, you can see he Gave him yeah. the bird. Yeah, they got into a <laughs> road rage bird. here. Road rage. Cut him off and... Yeah. And you can't even continue. You can yep. follow their separate paths. Yeah, so this one here, the guy on the bicycle, you can see him traveling along. So he came from off the map. Yep. Over this way, yep. To there. So yeah, and the same thing with the car. So you, can, yeah. you see them before what their triggered it. And then the, Yep, yep mm -hmm. exactly. So one of the ones cases we did, Deborah actually ran out of tiddlywinks for <laughs> the case. So I think, I imagine the long ones might end up using yeah. two colors. We're not going to pretend that we can do these all with just the, um, uh, with the one because it's going to be gigantic. Yeah. So all right. let's do the introductory case. Go ahead and read to us what we're supposed to do. <clears throat> the top hat. You can even, all right, put it over here. Yep. You can even see the little guy, I assume, that we're supposed to be following. Little Abe Lincoln fellow. <laughs> um, this is the start card for the case. The lead investigator now turns over the start card and reads the text on the back aloud. Introductory key case. Fernando Branco was on the way to his local pub. 
Upon arrival, he noticed that his top hat had disappeared. Uh-oh. The pub is located in the east of the city, between Neptune Park and the hardware store. Here's the hardware this store. This is Neptune Park. Now put this card aside. The next card on the oh, stack this. describes your first task on a black background. Find the pub. And this is Fernando wondering how he lost his top hat. Let's start with these pink ones, I guess. So here's... So the we're park finding and the pub. This is the hardware store. Here's the hardware store. store and the park. Say so, so. We need the pub with Fernando, who has a. I'll show you. Has a very pointy nose. He's very pointy Pinocchio. Nose. Okay. Abraham Lincoln. He has a crossover. <laughs> Snowman head. Snowman head. Yes. They all can. Oh, there he is. So that's the pub. I'd say. He's noticing his missing hat. Yes. Although, what is that showing? Isn't that... No, I think it's it's here. The it's the same the building, wine. though. Sure, but it's a different store. Ah, okay. You know, like, that looks like pills, like a drugstore or something, maybe? Yeah, it's on that sign, too. Maybe yeah. that's something else. But I think this is the pub with the... Oh, yeah, there you go. There's the, the icon. Ones. Okay. Okay, so that's number two. Turn it over to see whether you're correct. Yes, we are correct, as you can see here. The pub. Very good. That's the pub. Fernando stands in front of it and is surprised that his top hat has disappeared. He still had it on his head when he was at the sausage stand northeast of Neptune Park. He's sure of that. So there's the park. Is this northeast? There's the sausage stand, and there he is with his hat. There he goes. Okay. All right. We found the sausage stand. This is the sausage stand. Fernando can be seen making his way to the pub from here. At that point, he still had his top hat on his head. Um, well, here we go. What I, happened I on the way? I think we've already found it. Yes, because <laughs> he's he's here with his hat as well. And he must go into the park? Because where is he? Where does she... Te well, we maybe have to follow the kid with the fisher pole. Here he is. He's up in the tree. So, yes, up in the tree. He took his hat. And Do we see Fernando away. walking a little bit beyond that anywhere? Well, I mean, he then he's at the pub. He's real close. So what yep. happened on the way? Oh, wow. How was the top hat one. nicked? Yep. He, the person, very British, Britishy things. I don't know. Um, yes, there was a kid in a tree with a fishing pole. Dun dun dun. The crime scene. It happened on the way to the pub. The first, the two rascals fished the top hat off his head. Um, so now we want to know who are the, where are the culprits sitting with the loot? There they are. The two rascals are sitting on a park bench with their prize. Well done. You have now learned how to play the game and can now attempt to solve more complicated Oops. cases. Okay, well, that one's a quick one. Hey, what happened? Hey, what okay, happened? here we go. Go ahead and zoom back out, Nikki. Okay. <laughs> when I'd be curious, even though it's not part of the case, would we see the further adventures of any of those three characters? I know, that'd be... Cr Really cool. They thing. just go about their lives on the board. So let's try. Do you want to do a middle sized case since we're doing a tiny one? We could do three because that was pretty quick. <laughs> that, so was let's quick. Get, that was quick. Let's get a middle sized one here. Or three or something. Yeah. Dead cat. Ooh. Uh oh. Nikki will be sad. I'm Aww. sad already. Well, it's a cat person. Uh oh. It's probably a bad guy. Catherine. It's not. <laughs> you know, it's like it's not like a an actual cute He's cat. He's got a so. tie on, yeah, or a button yeah. shirt. It's it could be these the, are the all cat these cat are all animal know. people. Oh, okay. yeah, they yes. are. He's, it's just another dead humanoid in crime city. <laughs> humanoid, most dead dead humanoid crime, crime city. city. All right. It's such a terrible town. Dead cat. I do need. I do need to be using like a noiry. Yeah. Dead cat. Hello, detectives. <laughs> Your task is to solve a murder case. Mr. Cat was found dead in <laughs> Neptune Park. Hey, we're back to Neptune Get on Park. It. Yeah. Get on bad it. Bad things happen. Get on it. Get on it. I think bad things happen. Is this him bad right here? Bad things happen in Neptune Park. I think that is him. That looks like a dead. So let's zoom in on that. Mr. Cat, me. Zooming in on the Neptune. So find the dead Park. victim is our first task. And we did Correct. That. We completed it. The corpse. Mr. Cat lies dead in Neptune Park in the middle of a crowd. He has been stabbed. Oh. Poor Mr. Cat. Where did the killer lurk? Okay. So there must be someone with a knife in a bush or something. It was a stabbing. Okay. Yes, it was a stabbing. Is this him again, cat guy right here? No, that guy's got like little cheeks. Hmm. Oh, there's the knife. Isn't there's that a, knife. a knife. Okay, that is a knife. 
Couldn't so maybe that's how we, we he lurked in the bushes. I'm looking for like a hand sticking out or yeah. But the killer look is there. a real cat. No. Whoa! <laughs> There's a twist. I'm looking for like a dude with a knife in his mm -hmm. hand or in well, pocket. Why maybe has or... a disguise that he ditched oh, coming yeah. up or something like There's that. There's a hat too on the ground. But I do. I think that's it. I mean, I think it's in the bushes. Where did the killer lurk? Because they don't say find the killer. Sure. Okay. There so you let me go. see. Okay. Oh no! We're no, wrong. We're so wrong. So well, let's find it. There is a lurking. And it, he does. These are the. Those, those are, are his glasses yeah. and that thing. So we aren't off track. We just didn't find. The actual lurker. He's in the bushes. Oh, we have to find where Peeking Mr. Cat out. is fine. Here there we go. There we go. go. There they are. Dun dun. The culprit appears to have worn so the victim entered the park from the northern entrance. Here the murderer was spotted sneaking after the victim. The culprit appears to have worn a mask. Where is the murder weapon? That we did. And we are correct. Yay! The knife is near the crime scene behind a bush in the park. The culprit obviously fled in this direction. That's right. Where did the victim live? Well, should uh, we assume he's coming from home? Yeah. Sure. Briefcase. Cat with tower. briefcase. Oh, he came out of the subway. Ah. Okay, so, so we're we going to find another subway stop. We know he... there's one down here. Yeah. They're all there's actually, one they're all in there's one right here. That's him. Oh, we got him down He's here. All the way He's got over his coffee. Here. He's got <laughs> ice cream. Ice cream. So oh, smart. My He's cat. a smart Do cat. Do I need to zoom way out? No, no. Well, oh yeah, yeah. Might as well, so we can see where. A bit of how that's working. We linked it. Well, that was pretty fast that yeah. you found it. Yeah. So well. Sorry. Oh, sorry. I was looking for the other mm -hmm. subway. Well, so there's he, other stops here. There's one he here. He went here. So then. Where did he come from before that? I don't know if you want to zoom yeah, in on that. Yeah, we should zoom in on that. Well, he had an ice cream in his hand, so oh, an ice cream you're shop, so right? Smart. Yes. There's a hamburger stand. The knife, gun, and arrow store. Yeah. Here's the poison crime, store. Because Crime City needs, you know. Of course. Knife, gun, and poison store. A lot of alcohol in clouds. Oh, there he is with his ice cream. Oh. It's a long walk with his ice cream. Oh, here's ice cream over here. Is he there? Let's see. There he is. There he is. Okay. okay. Oh, he's got a we girl with to, him. We oh. need to slide. Okie dokie. Where did his girl go? Oh, they're saying goodbye to each other here. Bye. So Bye. then he's here with the ice, ice cream, ice cream. Wait, we does she look? Where we live. Does she look like she could be disguise, the person in disguise? Oh. And it's then hard to sell. He's in down there in disguise. So we're following. Well, there this must be way. a disguise shop that we see her at. Oh, here he is giving her flowers. So okay, far, we, we need don't know why. Again. Why he would be murdered? We still haven't figured out where he lives. That way. Uh, yeah, I think that's this one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Flower shop. Okay. Is he around there? Is that yep. him? Right here. He's thinking there. about and it. Here. I'm thinking. Is that him? No, that's not that's him. That's not. He's got buttons. He's very okay. catty like. Looking. Here he is. This is where he lives. He's coming out of okay. his house. We gotta come down now. Cool. I think okay. we got that. Let's, Let's see. Come on down. <laughs> Need a big table to play this game. Right. Yep. There Got we go. Him. The victim's home. Mr. Cat lived next to the fish shop. Appropriate. From here, he went on a long walk during which he had a quite a number of experiences. What is the motive for the murder? I'm going to zoom out that just so they can s big question. See you can see all the dots for Cat. Well, maybe it's not her. Maybe it's her husband. Or oh, her, you yeah. Know? We need to track her we down. We need to track so her. So we need to track her. So we need to go back to where he presented her with the flowers and then go That's backwards. That's here. Or where she went afterwards. Oh, sorry. Sorry. So between here and here, move my head, <laughs> is they walk together and then she's leaving here and she's, so we either want to see where she came from or where she went. Okay. Well, Lincoln's closer to where she came from. I'm going to look for where she yeah, went I'm when they you. I'll do that with you. parted ways. 
Oh, here she is. She dropped her flowers. Wow! What kind of That's woman right is there? this? No. Why would you do that? Because you're with another man right here. <gasps> Who's in a coat with and buttons. Like buttons that. and the mustache. Yes. All right. Well, hold on. Where did he end? Funny ears. Oh, he's like a wolf. He's getting out of a tower. He's getting in a taxi. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, and there's a taxi over here. Let me see. Yep, there's a taxi. So he took the taxi. Oh, my goodness. Mm. But how does he know? She's setting up the murder well, here. Well, let's zoom in and over here. Right? She's like, I want you to get this guy. Oh, it's not a jealous yeah. lover. Oh, here he's talking to a jewelry guy. Oh, to buy her a ring, maybe? Maybe. Which one? The nice cat? He gave her, the nice cat gave her flowers and wants to buy her a ring. Why would she knock him off? She's not nice. Because it's, you keep forgetting we're in Murder City in or murder whatever. Murder City. Crime City. Crime City. Murder <laughs> City. Yeah, I don't think it's just murder, but murder. Well, oh, here she is, right? Is that her coming out of her house? Must be. Man. We need to slide again. Well, but I'm, I'm with you. Why is she? We still don't know what the motive is. We just know that either she's setting him up to be killed or this other guy. Oh, my goodness. Do we follow the wolf? Yeah, so he got in a taxi and the taxi went. But before, what it, like before he met with her, do we follow him previous to? Because we know he got in the taxi and then took the taxi to go murder him. What was the next question? Well, this is, what is the motive for the murder? Okay, yeah, we can't really look. We don't quite have... Yeah, we shouldn't be looking at a card yet. A motive. We have... <laughs> look, there's a burglary at the bank. We have the means... Yeah, I don't see. I'm not finding this wolf guy. But we need to find what she's doing. I mean, we have her coming out of her house mm -hmm. and then meeting him. So we don't have a lot of information about Correct. her. I, I assume she starts at home. I don't know how we would track her previous to that. This isn't anybody we know yet, right? It's... No, not that I know of. I just want to know why she's talking to... I agree. It looks like she's... Because she's like, I don't care about him and his flowers. Mm-hmm. I'm going to tell this guy Well, that's why I'm wondering mm -hmm. if we should... <gasps> Maybe he's got money. Okay. Because he bought... He's going to get jewelry. Mm. He bought her all these nice things. She's going to kill him for the money? Well... Well, like, is she here and stealing his... Well, it wasn't she had the guy kill. I mean, oh, here we go. Here's the wolf man. <laughs> Leaving the crime. Woof. He's coming around the corner. He took his briefcase because his briefcase has jewels in it. Oh. Oh. Yep. Cause the Maybe guy, he is the jeweler. Well, the guy at the jewelry gave him the briefcase. The jewelry store gave yeah. him. So the motive is they're stealing the yeah, jewels. Yeah, the jewels. The jewels. We cool the turn? Yeah, let's find out. Yep, the diamond case. Mr. Cat received a suitcase filled with diamonds. The suitcase was obviously the target for the killer because it can no longer be found at the crime scene. Oh, boy. Where did the killer find out about the diamonds? From the girlfriend. Oh, okay. Right? Yep. Mr. Cat had a girlfriend who was there when he received the diamonds. She informed Mr. Fox. Yeah. I'm sorry, I misidentified him as a wolf. That's yeah, okay. Close enough. <laughs> Where did the killer get the disguise? No. Oh, so it's the, it's we need to follow story. the taxi. Because he gets in a taxi. Here's a taxi. So is he Fox guy there? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah, he's still normal. And then Mr. Fox gets in the taxi. Then here's the taxi. Here's the taxi. I wonder if they use this. Since they don't show people in the taxi, I wonder if they use it. Here's taxi over here, too. I mean, it might not be the yeah, same taxi. But here he is getting, getting out. Getting okay, out. Yeah. Of, from the costume Cla store. Yeah, costume store. Okay, okay, there we go. Do we see him inside the yep. store anywhere? Costume store. Uh, no, but he's outside holding a hat in him. Yeah. yeah, let's put it on that clown face there. We might need that token. Okay. The murderer has been found guilty. Witnesses saw Mr. Fox get the disguise in the costume shop. 
When he got back in the same taxi, he went to the store in and headed to the scene of the... Oh, when he got back in the same taxi, he went to the store in and headed to the scene of the crime. Okay. Oh. How did the killer flee? Well, on foot so far. Mm. Did he flee? Oh, no, he got on the bus to the concert. <laughs> But right. he's got the costume still on, right? Isn't No, he left the costume you know off. He's not wearing it here. Oh, I see. Or I here. see. He is a fox guy, but he has another costume. Well, where's he at over here then? Well, he's not. He he was peeking out of the bushes yeah. here. Right. Killed him and then left the knife and the costume there and then he's walking here to the bus stop. Yep. To go to the concert. Now, is he at the concert? Is the question. Did he get lost in the crowd at the concert? Or is, or is the answer to how did he flee the bus? By the bus, I would think, yeah. Okay. So I think bus. Bus. Mr. Fox fled by bus from the bus stop at the hardware store. The bus was heading towards the graveyard, which is the name of the nightclub. The nightclub up or here. Or the real graveyard that's up there. Oh, maybe that too. <laughs> there are... Uh, <laughs> where does the killer live is our last question. He went up to the graveyard. We want to know where he lives now. Was he going home? We don't know. Maybe he lives... Well, like, maybe we want to find him previous to. I don't know. Do we ever see the the bus, like, unloading people? No, we just see it over here. Okay. As far as I can tell. Well, yeah, you guys look at the... I'm, I'm, you know, Lincoln, I'm going to see if I can find him previous to his... Here he is over here. Okay. And he's that's got the, the case, and that's the bus. Oh, the bus is there. Okay. So you have to figure out where. Oh, there he lives. Okay. All right. Let's see. Go down. Last card. Yes. Excellent. You caught him. Mr. Fox lives in the north of the city next to the gourmet restaurant. Good job, detectives. That's Miss Betty, I think, or something. <laughs> so there you go. There's the, the full entirety view, of this yeah. one on this. I love it though. I love it's that it's so all over the place. Cool. There you go. Okay. Too much. Oh, that's good. So there's that one. That's pretty. That it's was a, a medium-sized case. A lot yeah. of pink dots everywhere. <laughs> and we only had two left. So wait till we do the big one. It's going to be all over the place. We're doing a five, right? Yes. We're going to do a five. So what do we want to do? The Sunday stroll or the carnival? Mm. Carnival sounds fun. It does sound fun. So we'll do the carnival. Okay. Nice. Reset. Reset. Good. I've been joking that I want, I want to color. You're not, this you're not in. joking. I know you're telling us the truth. There's no. I'll send you a picture <laughs> after I buy this and color it in, and following each crime through its. I love it iterations. though. It's so clever. Carnival. <laughs> Where is the carnival? We'll find out. Another puzzling murder has occurred. A body has been found on the riverbank in the east of the city. It's a um, cowboy who was shot. That's what it says. It's a um, cowboy who was shot dead with an arrow. There is no trace of the culprit. So Riverside, somewhere over here, I assume. Is he going to have a cowboy hat? He, it's next to him. You know, he's dead on the ground with a cowboy hat. Oh, here he is. He's dead. All right, he is dead. Okay, let's zoom in on that. All right. Where was the victim before his death? So there's where we're starting. Dead cowboy. Dead cowboy. Dead um cowboy. Um. What was cowboy. The, I'm sorry. What was the question next? What? Uh, it was where was the victim before his death? Is that him? No, it's not. No, cowboy it's a hat. pirate. Oh yeah, I see a hook. <laughs> Looking at hats. Yep. Okay. Um, it's a whole bunch of people with arrows. Oh, there's a person. Here. Yeah. There's the yeah. Native, Native American. Native American. American. But we got a knight. Oh, archery. An archer. Like a like a Wonder Woman elven type. Wonder Woman Is that lady. A Yoda next to him. Okay. And then there's another. Okay, well, it's the there, same guy. Yeah. There's the name. Okay. Does he have the arrows? He does. He I does. He still has But arrows. isn't this the guy? There's the guy you, talking to the wizard or the witch. Witch lady. Okay, so this is this costume. So where was the victim before his death is like a costume or a renaissance fair. Or... Okay, well, let's see what it says. I guess it could be the carnival, right? Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> it's the carnival. The costume party. Oh. 
The cowboy was further up the street at a costume party before his death. Okay. Are there any suspects? Well, we've got a bunch. We'll so, say yes. There you uh, go. Three people: the Native American, the Amazon warrior. There you go. Joe, Amazon warrior. Robin Hood. Oh. I guess that's Robin Hood. That must be Robin, Robin Hood. Hood. Okay. okay. What job does Robin Hood have in real life? Oh no. Move this card next to the deck so the question below can also be seen. Aha. So basically, what job do these three suspects have in real life? Let me zoom out. Oh, just put them in here. Mm -hmm. Well, I think our okay. world is going to yeah, expand it's going to a little. Yeah. Yep. Well, who do we want to follow first? I mean, this is a five or five star, so yeah, I guess it's big. It's, it'll be. In fact, we can use different colors. We're going to have to. As a matter of fact, that's a great idea. Yeah. We'll do that specifically. Uh, well, for uh, clearly, Robin Hood needs to be the green. green. Yes, yes, okay, well, let's start with Robin Hood. Then. <laughs> yes. Let me put so the pink Robin back. Hood. So pink is the victim. Okay, green. Okay. I mean, obviously, we only have three colors, but yeah, we'll go from there. All right, so okay. we're starting with that's Robin good, though. Hood. We'll leave that there and pull this to the side. Okay. Is that him there? No, that's the Amazon warrior. Here he is. Okay, they're all well, coming the from the same direction. direction. Oh, oh, that's Native American. That Sorry. is the Native there's, American. There's Robin Hood. Okay. Okay. So they're all coming. They are. From the same place. Here's her, Native American. Where's the... Where is it? But here we don't know where... I don't see no, Robin. but there she is. Mm-hmm. Amazon. Well, we're looking for Robin so let's, Hood. Well, yeah, but we're gonna yeah we're for, but we're gonna also start with yeah. Amazon. One will will be yellow. Gold. Okay. She's here and there if you wanna catch her. But uh, actually, the trail I'm losing is Robin Hood. Yeah, it's he he's, just, here he's here and, and then he's I'm, gone. I'm having trouble finding where he came from. Before. I'm gonna use my... that hat. Oh, there you go. What does his face look like? He's got a big round nose. So do you think that he and is definitely ears. traveling? Was well, this cowboy hat guy right here? Well, yes, I was gonna say I saw him. He's also here. What is he with there? Like, is he doing something to he that lady? He stepped on that... her skirt. Oh. Princess. Yeah. Well, that wasn't very are. nice. I mean, Did this so... is a whole other track, but here they are again. Maybe she's friends with Robin Hood or something, right? Maybe, and she's like Robin Hood. Yeah. Oh, here she goes. We're, I mean, we're following the wrong thing, but... <laughs> yeah, I know. We were going to start with Robin Hood, and you know. everybody's you get like, caught up on... I don't know where Robin Hood went. Well, let's let's go... We'll go down there and look at it specifically just for him for a little bit. Yes, yeah, so this is where he... The last we see of him... Um, so Batman. <laughs> There's the he's holding Native American. Bow. Is this and Robin her. Hood? Oh, yeah. Well, he doesn't have a bow at that point. Where does he get his bow? So there's... You need to slide. There's... And... Okay. Slide American. or zoom out. Yeah, let's slide. I wonder if they're traveling together. I mean, they seem to be in the kind same... Kind of. They're, well, they're, they're not all they're just the coming same. from the same place to the same place. Well, they're all coming from the costume store, but right? But here, he has no bow and arrow. And here, he has a bow and arrow. So where does that happen in his path? That he gets a bow and arrow. Maybe he's going in here to get it? I don't know they would have he's it. He's walking this way mm -hmm. now. Well, he's right here, but I mean, is there, a there could be something that happens before that point, right? Well, that's what I was thinking. Okay, go this way or mm -hmm. that way. But then he's here. So somewhere between here and here. I know. Well, the reality is, is, but he could have got... Well, you're right. It's He's left there the, and he doesn't have the it. The friendly neighborhood bow and arrow sells. <laughs> well, it is a market there. Is there a weapons place? I know I'm seeing, like, frites Flowers. and cheese. Yeah. Sausages. Wait, here he is here. No Green. bow and arrow. Yeah. He's walking all over the place. Do he's we see... got to be in this crowd somewhere. We're trying to figure out what his job is oh, in that's real right. life. Mm -hmm. So while the bow and arrow is a super mystery. Here he is again. So that's how he cuts through cut the through. market. He came through that way. Okay. Okay. You're well, right. Well, that makes me wonder if the... We need to slide that way. Sure. Okay. Yeah, he's definitely, you're right. He's definitely cutting through like that. 
Here he is. Oh, okay. I was getting hung up on that guy right there. I'm like, is that him without his costume? Oh, pizza delivery. Or fruit or something. This is the money store. <laughs> you need to go buy That's some money. Saying, there's a, one of them that shows somebody. Is this him with now a bow and arrow? From the back. From the back. So he came. But again. So there's maybe this a is loop actually a loop. somewhere yep, in here. You're right. It's a loop. This is him returning to go catch up over here. Here he is. Sans, sans arrows. Mm -hmm. So that's this is still the trip down. Weapons. There you uh -huh. go. And, he and there weapon. he is. Okay, that so answers that question. Two. We still don't know what job he has in real life. <laughs> no, we don't. So we want to keep going this way, I guess. So we need to go back up. There. Yeah. Okay. We, we gotta go. We did the loop. We now know how he got his. He detoured to go buy a bow and arrow. Yeah. Which is suspicious, frankly. Correct. A real one, nonetheless. I know. So here's. We need to go backward from here to figure out what his job is. Job or apartment? Yeah, maybe he's. Got is like, this cowboy guy here too? Yep. I pink. forgot what color uh, cowboy he's guy pink, was. Yes. Is that cowboy guy? No, it's a clown. Okay. A, clown. a clown. He's a flippity gibbet. Mm -hmm. What is his job in real life? Does he dress as Robin Hood all the time? Maybe. Maybe she's kind of. I'm looking work. here. This Maybe. is him before he went into the costume shop. Okay. To You're get right. his clothes. Awesome. You are correct. That is really close, like difficult, but yes. That's the nose and That's ears. That's the nose and ears. So now we're wow. following this guy. Yes. Woo! To find out what he does in real life. We found him? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Okay. Do we need to move over? He's here now. So he's going to be there too, right? Yes. Um. Is that him sitting there? Yes, he put his jacket on. Okay, that's still is not a, his job. He's a sculptor. Oh, is he sculpting there? Oh, yes, yeah, he's an artist. Bit. Okay. All right. Should we try? Let's see. Yeah. yeah. Sculptor. Woohoo! In real life, Robin Hood is called Robert Huber and is a sculptor. His workshop is next to the beer garden in the city center. Sweet. Okay. So that's the first one. Now we got to find the other two people. Yes. Right? Follow Wonder Woman and the Native American. Well, I already feel Robin Hood's probably the guy just because he's out specifically getting arrows. I've been putting the wrong color on this guy. Which color? Uh, for that guy? Pink oh, for, is that guy. for the cowboy? Yeah, the cowboy. I'll just cover what we already did. Pink here. is for blood. Yes. Um, well, we. So we go back to the three. So, yes, yeah, so here we go. So we want to follow the Native American or. Sure. Sure. All right, so here's orange. I mean, he's got a really basic face. Your base. Your base. Your basic face. It's like a bunny rabbit face without ears. Yeah, he's got like a heart-shaped head. Maybe this is him. Yeah, looks like a heart-shaped head. Running to the costume store? Yeah, I would say mm -hmm. that's probably... Okay. Here he is again. He's still running. He's in a hurry. He's a jogger. Okay, we need to move. And there he is again. Whoopsies. That's so there another go. orange. Okay. Then. Sorry. There well, here's there. the guy buying the Robin Hood go. stuff. I knew they'd be inside the store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll put a green one on that just for, yeah, just for fun. Funsies. Kicks and giggles. But no, I can't find there it is. And he really ran all the way. There he is. Big there he is hurry. also. Oh, there in, he is, yeah. In there. Getting the feathers. So we're. Orange guy. Kind of lost. Is that him? Is that him going? Yep. Hey. Well, or he, um. Scratching his head. Oh, maybe did he. Oh, his car broke down. Oh, 
Okay. That's why he lost. He lost a wheel on his car. We need to move. <laughs> Sorry. Quite the. Uh, there we go. There's my finger. Go. So there's okay. him with his broken down car. So now we're looking for his car. Him yeah, and his has car. This, it doesn't have the That's front. It. No, because it doesn't have the front triangle. Oh yeah. Oh. The, the rectangle. So this is yeah, his yeah, car. Yeah. Yep. We need yeah, with two the two trapezoids. Here we go, up here. Yeah. Back wait, here. Wait, that, that, oh, no, it's oh, got I the see. front. See that's not the car. Oh it's though. not, it you're right. It has the, to go the, all the way the, back. I think his car Sorry, it's is the single one yeah. without the so triangle this one. on the hook on the right. Yeah. Yeah. Where's his broken down car again? Oh, right Oops. there. Yeah. yeah, right here. So just the single trapezoid on top. Yeah. So then here and here. here. Yeah. He bought we it. Just bought it, and we bought a lemon. Okay, we need to come down Who now. Who did he buy it from? Cowboy guy. Oh, is that the motive? He might have, yes. It's very close. Hold right on. here? That's too funny. Is that cowboy guy? It sure uh, looks is. like him without the hat. He just doesn't hat. have a hat yet. Because uh -oh. here he is putting on his hat. <laughs> We're getting too far ahead. What is his real job? What is what is heart heart headed real real job? That's what we're trying to answer. Let's see if we can zoom up in that oh, corner. Oh, look at these weird humans. Yeah. The, oh, they oh, got masks. masks. Those masks. Ah, they're human masks. You can masks. see them in the window of the costume <laughs> store. That terrifying. <laughs> they're like they're like the V's for Vendetta masks. Yes, that's so scary. <laughs> All right, Hearthead, where'd you come from? I don't know. I'm looking anywhere in this area, right? Maybe he's like the lighting guy at mm -hmm. the concert or something. Okay, here he is walking he there. Mm. Oh, here he is. He's a dentist. Oh, wow. A dentist. Or yeah, a tooth oral salesman. hygienist. We need. Oh, no, it's Dental still hygienist. On, the, on the camera. Cool. Let's pull these things out. All right. Okay, who so. Who needs then, After Effects, Nikki P? Who needs After Effects when you can do the magnifying glass? Here we go. Okay. Okay, so here we go. So the job the Native American has is a dentist. Yay! In real life, the Native American is the dentist, Dr. Dentovich. <laughs> Dentovich? Wow, with a name like that. How could he not be a dentist? His practice is in the north of the city. Sweet. Amazon warrior, what does she do? I don't know, so we go back to here, right? And yellow. Yellow for Lincoln. <laughs> yellow. Okay. So what does she look like after coming out of the place, or come, okay. before coming in? She's got a also breastplate. kind of a heart shape. Okay, head. so she's inside here. This is this her right here? Yes, okay. you're right. So she's, she's got, got that got, hair, like, a bob hair and, cut. Oh, this is the lady whose dress he stepped on. Oh, oh. boy, more than one uh, motive. Yes. Um, uh oh. So because she's back here, she was a princess. And she's going to go get her Amazon costume. Because here he is stepping on her. Who stepped on her? It's, the now what's going on here? Guy? What's happening? Jeez, he's causing she's, all she's kinds like, of trouble. Hey, dude, you just messed up my, my costume. Wait. Ruined my costume. So yes, here she's going, dude, you, you stepped on my costume. You ruined it. Because this is where he did it. And then she goes off to buy one. Okay, so, so where's she So what's her job at? in real life? So she came well, from... Well, but she might be over here, too, right? Well, no, but... Is this oh, her? Right, is this her? from here. Maybe. So here she is as a princess. Mm. Okay. Put so we'll keep, there. Yeah, we'll there she is right there it. coming out of... Oh, she's a lawyer. She's a lawyer. Well, okay. that guy's She, does, she doesn't need to murder him. You gotta him. mark that she was a princess right there. Somewhere she got changed. Oh, well, here she's coming out of there. Yeah, I yeah, see. So she's a lawyer. So she's a lawyer. So she's just gonna sue him. She's not gonna... Yeah. Him. All right, let's see. Lawyer, the Amazon pr warrior, previously dressed as a princess, lives in a villa on the northeast side of the city. She is the ace lawyer, Connie Comfort. <laughs> okay. Have you been involved in an accident? 
Yeah. Call Connie Comfort. All right, what job does the cowboy have in real life? He's a car salesman. Car salesman. Car right? salesman. Used car dealer. He is the used car dealer Chris Corvette. He, <laughs> li he lives on his business premises located in the northwest of the city. Does the Amazon warrior have a motive? Yes. Ruin her dress. Yeah. The lawyer was in a fancy dress as a princess when she left for the costume party. On the way, however, the cowboy stepped on her dress and she stumbled. Her dress tore and she, and she most certainly was not amused. Furious, she made a detour to the costume shop to get a new outfit. Ta-da! Does the Native American have a motive? Uh, which one was he? Yeah, he was... Oh, wait, Buying no. the car. He's yes, the car he's buyer. the car guy. He okay, was, so he the car buyer? He bought a lemon. Yeah. Yep, junk car. The dentist had bought a car from the used car dealer. He didn't get far until the car lost a wheel. He ran as fast as he could because he had a date at the costume party. But he arrived too late. He still met with the pretty pirate lady, but she had waited too long for him and went home annoyed. <laughs> so it was a double, double motive. <laughs> Does Robin Hood have a motive? Yeah, he... Oh, wait. Was he the sure car? He him. was in the car. No. We Robin Hood, we stopped at where he found his job and he's walking. I mean, he is obsessed with what must be a woman who left him or something like that. We don't have any information that the cowboy... Well, let's just look around here and well, see if we Well, here's the cowboy. Him. Cool. He's... Pink, right? Mm -hmm. It's probably just more, but, of, but still, we might see I'm an interaction. I'm wondering if yeah. there's an interaction yeah. with that guy. He lives above the his used car dealership, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's that? Oops, <gasps> that's her. Yep. He's in love with the cowboy's girlfriend. Okay, there okay. we go. Okay, okay. Obsessed. Did we get it. The rival. The sculptor was still in love with his ex-girlfriend, Gisela. A picture of the two still hangs over his bed and even made a sculpture of her. She left him some time ago and now lives with the used car dealer, Chris Corvette. Wow. Oh, boy. After all this, who is the killer and how can we convict them? <laughs> I have no clue where we would go from here. No. Well, the only guy that bought that we saw by a real bow and arrow. That's a good point. Is the artist. Um, no, it was no, Robin was Hood. was Robin Hood. That's the artist. Oh, uh, yes, you're right. It's green, come on, we know. Green, okay, green. green. We, we, we've coded it. All right. We did color code it. Everyone else, he's also uh, at the party alone. Like he's not, he's just there, he's not interacting. So there's gonna be some more down there with the, Robin Hood. The other thing is, she comes out of the co uh, co or that guy comes out of the costume store with a bow and arrow. Mm -hmm. She comes out of the costume store with a bow and arrow. So he does not mm -hmm. come Those out of the costume fake bow store. And arrows. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're absolutely right. All right, so we're going Robin Hood artist. He bought a real bow and arrow. Yeah. The Arrows! Yay! The sculptor Robert <laughs> Huber, a.k.a. Robin Hood, was the only one who did not buy his bow and arrows in the costume shop. He made a detour to the gun shop where he picked up some very real and very deadly arrows. Very impressive, detectives. That was a tricky case. Wow, that is amazing. That's Look at so how much cool. this covers. And if there was ever a advertisement for these little <laughs> clear yeah, yeah. widgets. This tiddly winks. Tiddly winks. Yeah. So the green goes all the way. Yeah, because yeah, here's the real, the gun store. It goes all the way down and around and then up. He killed insane. the cowboy guy. No. The cowboy. The uh, cowboy, was that what it was? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> who was a used car dealership who stole his lady. Well, he also bought a car from him, right? So he. No, not... that was the other guy. Oh, yeah, that was the other guy. Okay. That was orange. That's he's funny. not. He's not angry enough to kill a guy. Yeah. yeah, he's not. He's had to I'm run. Just, I'm yeah. just a couple of the other ones of yeah, him, him going, going back. Walking, going Since back. we knew what he was doing, yeah. we, didn't we didn't follow super the, the rest. Yeah. yeah. That's but more yes. of the. Uh, it's just more of Robin Hood. The back of him going wow. back up to, basically the the, weapon store. Right. Yeah. We, going we back. Turning. <laughs> well, he really went over the place too, yeah. though. Yeah, is there any? Do we see him anywhere down here near the the crime Not scene? That I other was than looking that one, and I don't see mm. him. No. I mean, your your clue is this: him buying an yes. actual weapon. Yeah. Yes. 
Well, I'm just trying to look for like him without his costume on, because maybe he, you know, tore it off. But I, I don't see him. Threw it in the river. Yeah. Oh, that would be fun if you saw floating. floating. Well, that might give it away too fast. Yeah. I don't know. Well, just the bow and arrow floating in the river would be good enough. Mm-hmm. Since that's they all true. had bow that's and arrows, true. right? Yeah, that's smart. That's smart. <laughs> well, cool. well, that's what a five you, one. Yeah, what do you think, Nick? That was really fun. I liked that it. Yeah, the branching. Uh, uh, went from here and then out. That was that was pretty cool. Well, we didn't really follow the cowboy guy, but it, we didn't really need to. We mm -hmm. just needed to know where he worked. Right. Well, there he is over here too. So they're all, you know, they're, they're all over the place. Mm -hmm. There he is over there. Kind of looks like Mr. Poopy Butthole there. I know, but they all. They're they're doing their things mm -hmm. and then they all come together Converge, yeah. to mm -hmm. to the party thing. That is really cool. Yeah. What do you think, Deborah? I mean, I mean, I know you're already buying it. She's <laughs> already so like, okay, fun. let me pull it up on my iPhone and see if I can buy this. Well, I like that. I mean, I, obviously the cards is one element of it, but I kind of like you can even play without the cards. Absolutely. You can just pick a person or pick a crime yep. and follow and it. Follow it. Um, I'm super excited about the coloring opportunities. Um, it's so tiny, though. You're gonna have to keep those pencils or pens. Yeah. Get I guess some you, nice you use fine those. You, you use those uh, markers that you have with the I super get the microns. Micron, yeah, yeah, you can do it with those. Fine do you have multiple colors on those? You can get them. Yeah. I usually only use black for the microns, yeah. but um, but I have a bunch of fine liners with colors that would do just fine for this. But it's this so is, wee. It feels like a. Well, I did get into the coloring thing, and <laughs> there was a. Uh, Sharpie actually makes oh. a kit of fine that bunch of good, colors. This is a glossy. and of course Mars Stetzler not, has just, gorgeous colors, good. but also very it's fine clay. points. Yeah, I love like rolling back their day mm -hmm. or whatever or, or the amount of time, whatever. The the one that Deborah found inadvertently was yeah. a love story one that just clearly Everywhere. went over. Yeah, and it went over several several days. Um, but I really love that. What There's, even like. Like, look, there's just scissors on top right. of a building. And, and I'm like, what? Somebody threw the weapon out at the top. I just want to know. Follow the scissors. Follow the scissors. Well, we've like, got the piano crushing a guy here. Yeah. yeah. So someone cut the, the rope. Oh, that's right. What it's yeah, crushed be. the. And the, he's, I tracked him over here with his racket. So he's a famous, like, tennis player or something. <laughs> but even that, like, I, I have a whole story now. Right. I know who they are. It's just so interesting. And. Well, then there's these two yeah. people racing, running the horses down the street. Yes, what's that? About? I don't know what that's about. They disappear here. I love that you can follow the cars. That they're, you know, just unique enough. Yeah. I guess there must be just one taxi. I don't know. I think, I think so. I mean, unless the taxi. But I wonder has, if they, no, use, like I was saying earlier, no, if they use it for the taxi a, here, but it's different but it's, shape. Oh, okay. Yeah, there you yeah, go. Than yeah, that, that taxi. One, where the sign is. Yeah. Yeah. I do like the guy running. Go, you know. <laughs> you just, I'm late. I gotta make. I gotta meet my pirate lady. So, but then that was something. So there must be something more here where she's like, no, I don't want to date you. You know. Well, didn't, she, he, didn't they say that? Oh. He did talk, meet with her, but she was. She, she she's was too mad late. that he's late. So here she is. Oh come on. I know. Come on, lady. Um. So here she is. Like I. I wonder if you. You know, if you follow them, maybe he. Maybe he kills her. Oh, that would be terrible. It would be terrible. Just because she spurned her advances. Well, it's mm -hmm. really cool. This is very innovative. Is that Robin Hood it's, without the costume? No, okay. he had uh, lines on his shirt. Okay. I have joked about it, where's Waldo? But where's Waldo? You're looking for one guy yeah. Yeah. In, a, in a picture. This is digging deeper and looking and seeing if you can find out. I, I can see why they didn't Scissors. color it, obviously. Scissors. <laughs> Oh, there well, you you're go. following a story. Yeah. You're following yeah. a. But yeah, it's sort of like yeah. Where's Waddle with the black stories kind of thing, where you're trying to figure out the crime. Not really black stories, because you're deducing things with black stories. This you're just rolling back, mm -hmm. yeah. trying to find where they interacted, what might have led them to, you know, be ad, you know, an adversary or whatever. Yeah, I mean, you're deducing a tad like motive and things like that, but it's also clear. Well, you know? it's funny because we the lawyer was just upset that he'd stepped on her. Right. She just, it doesn't seem like she, you know, wasn't that big of a deal. Yeah, well, she, did, she didn't end up being the, the killer. Well, you don't know. There's, you know, road rage and all kinds oh, of stuff, <laughs> so it might have been enough. What's fun, though, <laughs> is like them being in different orientations. So you uh -huh. have to sometimes look for them 
with their back to you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love this though. I love the costume store where you see the changes. Yes. And yeah. everybody's inside the store. You see them yeah. buying well, each that, thing. It's so clever to have them look different. Yes. Because we, yeah. we were stuck for a minute going, well, I don't see that hat before we realized he didn't look the same. Right. It's just such a great little piece of it. Well, the designer of the game is also one of the artists, I believe. Okay. And I just, I think that they have a great idea here. I, already, mm. I know there's already a, another game in this series coming. I know this is a little bit hard to get, but I'm hmm. sure it's coming soon. Sure. And uh, this is really great. And you don't have to destroy it to, no. to play it. Deborah's, no. Deborah's just going to just... No. I'm just She's not destroying it, though. I mean, I don't think that you... It, as long as you... That's what you got to probably do with colored pencils, because yeah. then you can do layering, and it would be yeah. you know, di different colors and well, stuff. Well, and but part of it is I, I do think once you solve, there is a one-time usage sort of piece of sure, it. Sure, sure. So, but if, I mean, you can give it, was, it to others to play. I mean, you could. Eric, this was Eric um, Eric Martin's copy, and he sent it along to us mm -hmm. so we could actually cover it. Yeah. And you know, it's perfectly playable. Nothing. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, the only other issue is like I think Brian. He got and Scott and Brian got an Italian copy of this. So the okay. although I don't the know why, yeah, I don't know why you couldn't use the Google were, Translate to yeah. actually get them to yeah, work. But but yeah, this is really yeah. fun, really neat game, really neat mm. idea. Super. I mean, I wonder how they even came up with this idea. It's so great, really, really fun. Well, and using the these plastic winks, yeah. Oh, yeah. to make stuff stand out yeah. and all that, and it doesn't harm it. But mm. we've heard that people have put them up on. With wall, you know, walls, yeah, board pins. on oh, walls sure. and yeah, done yeah, yeah. with pins and standing at it and yeah, stuff like that. That makes sense, yeah. This is Chad Chad Crejean's idea to do the tiddlywinks. Yeah. I think it's great too, particularly mm. with these branching story. We got this branching story where they all converge over here. Mm -hmm. You could get into it with the pins and the string, yeah, and yeah. you can have <laughs> the whole. <laughs> well, this works, right? You see it all. But yeah. I think even the colored pins, if you just use different pin heads, that, right, that would right. be great. Right, right. Different color thread. And, yeah. But yeah, there's so many stores. I want to know what this is. Mm -hmm. I guess that's an, get to it. Like a corporation, maybe, or, or something? Yeah. yeah. Corporation-y? Or there's information. A there's sort of an eye inside the house. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Could be web. Uh-huh. But look at the pluses on the ground. Oh, those are chairs. Yeah, yeah. those are chairs. Mm -hmm. With the wheels. It's just really, it's just really interesting. And Look at there's a hatchet in the back of the truck with trash bags. What's Stop that about? That yeah, stuff. Yeah, I know, I know. It's gonna spoil. You're gonna want to spoil more. Well, I, yeah. yeah, the whole time we've been talking, well, the, I'm barely the listening. Hard, the, <laughs> the, the hardest thing is to stop looking. Yes, it's yeah. really hard. Well, it's yeah. that. It's that well done. There's really great yeah. stuff here. There's a skate park in here somewhere too. Mm -hmm. I haven't come across it yet. It's up at the top. Uh, okay. There, right yep. in front of See, I'm always here on I this know. side of the table, <laughs> so that whole top half of the map is a little, is a mystery. Well, you know, the thing we <laughs> discovered with the top down, like, you do want to lean over it and yeah. walk around the table and, you know, see, so you, you get space. Head. <laughs> well, I actually did okay upside down. I okay, know when yeah. I initially did this, I was having a hard, I think just getting, looking at it for a while and getting your bearings from yes. that perspective works really well. Because, I mean, I found the cowboy a bunch. Of course, he's right in front of me. Right. Um, but uh, really cool. I love. <laughs> I love that the guy's a dentist too. You know, <laughs> like the guys that are have the real jobs. What does Robin Hood do? He's a sculptor. 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 Yeah. See, he doesn't have the real job. He's not. He's got some issues there. A. I'm just teasing. Artist. Teasing. What yeah, are you yeah. just trying to say? He's just a torn artist, and he's frustrated that his love, <laughs> his obsessed with love, has been with another person. Mm -hmm. Well, cool. Thanks for playing. Thank you for teaching, Lincoln. Absolutely. And thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and consider subscribing to our channel. If you click on the bell, you'll get notified when we put up new videos. See you next time. Bye. Bye.